Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be sharing with you some of my favorite breakfast meal preps. Being on a weight loss journey, I have found it so important that I'm eating throughout the entire day, but also being a busy mom, I noticed one of the hardest things for me is to actually sit down and eat something that's healthy and filling and not just on the go all the time during the day. Dinners are easier for me because I'm always making dinner for my family, but making sure I have options available to me that are easy, and fast in the mornings for breakfast is one of my hardest struggles. So I've made three meal prep breakfasts that I can keep in my freezer for up to a month, make them in bulk ahead of time, grab them and go when I'm ready, and the best part is my family and kids will eat them too. So this morning I made breakfast burritos. These are filling, they're easy to pop from the freezer right into the air fryer or into your oven or microwave. They're packed with some protein, and I serve it with even more protein by doing Greek yogurt instead of sour cream and some zero point salsa. I follow the WW plan, so I'm gonna be sharing all of the WW points for the meals I'm sharing today. And don't worry for any of you out there who aren't big on eggs in the morning, I have two other recipes that are of like the sweeter breakfast variety that aren't just doing eggs. There are eggs in the recipe, but you can swap those for an egg substitute if you're allergic to eggs but they are not an egg-based breakfast. You gotta get a good dip of both. So good, and only six points on the WW plan. Here's a look at this recipe, and then I actually filmed the other two yesterday, because that's the other thing, as a busy mama, it's hard for me to lock in a few hours at a time to do meal prep. So what I've been doing is spreading it out over a day or two, doing a couple recipes, freezing things, and then I have some stuff that's ready to go in my fridge when I just don't have the time to be cooking full on meals for three meals a day for myself. So here's a look at our breakfast burritos, and then stay tuned for two more amazing breakfast preps that the kids even help me with. Breakfast burritos are a great option for meal preps in the morning. Today I'm doing chicken apple sausage, bell peppers, onions, and spinach, along with scrambled eggs. I started with my pan over medium heat on the stove with a light spray of avocado oil, and then I added half of this bag of frozen pepper and onion blend. After letting them cook down for a few minutes, I added in half a bag, about three ounces of baby spinach, and let that all wilt and saute together. In the meantime, I sliced up this package of chicken apple sausage. There's five of them. I'm adding those into my frying pan as well. Spy my little sous chef in the background. For seasoning, I'm using Kinder's The Blend, which is salt, pepper, and garlic, as well as the wood-fired garlic seasoning for a nice smoky flavor. Switching up ingredients that go into these burritos and seasonings help add variety so you don't get sick of them over the course of the month. Another great breakfast burrito filling I love is sauteed potatoes, breakfast sausage, either turkey or pork, along with zucchini and squash. While that mix cooks down, I'm adding six whole eggs to a large bowl, along with one cup of 2% low-fat cottage cheese and whisking until well combined. I set my veggie and sausage mix aside, and in the same pan, I'm going to scramble my eggs. If you're someone who's not a big fan of the texture of cottage cheese, just pop this mixture into a blender before scrambling. The cottage cheese adds extra protein as well as moisture, and I feel like I get some of that cheesy feel and taste without adding extra additional cheese and more points to this breakfast. I have my burrito stuffing station all set up, I tear off squares of aluminum foil, put down one low carb taco shell, and then fill each with a couple scoops of my sausage and veg mix and scrambled eggs and tightly roll them up. I figured out my points for this meal by entering all of the ingredients into a recipe in the WW app and then dividing by the number of burritos it made for servings and counting for one burrito to be one serving. And these came in at six points each on the WW plan. Hey, good morning. We're making waffles. For our healthy freezer waffles, I'm using the Krusty's Light and Fluffy Buttermilk Pancake Mix. I'm following the instructions on the back of the bag for waffles. However, 
I'm swapping out the vegetable oil for unsweetened applesauce and also adding in two heaping tablespoons of chia seeds. These add a great boost of fiber as well as a little bit of protein to our waffles. And once they're mixed into the batter, you can't really see or taste them in the cooked waffle. I love using my Mrs. Dash mini waffle maker. These make them just like the Eggos you buy at the store, but you're saving money and adding your own healthy twist by making them at home. I use a quarter cup of batter per waffle, so I know they're all the same, as well as I'm not overflowing my mini waffle maker. These cook all the way through in just a minute or so, and I can make a huge batch that I let cool fully, transfer to a gallon Ziploc bag, and then put in the freezer. These are a great base, and then you can add lots of fun different toppings. We love adding fresh fruit, a little bit of pure maple syrup, or even using PB2 powder to make our own healthier peanut butter drizzled on top. And my kids are always excited for waffles for breakfast. You can up the protein in these by adding some protein powder. I personally don't serve my kids protein powder and these are for all of us, so I'm not adding it today. But you could easily add a scoop or two and just adjust your water to make the right consistency of the batter. But as is without the protein powder today, these waffles come in at five points for two on the WW plan. Mashing bananas. Mashing bananas. I got my two little chefs. We're making what, Lila? Banana muffins. Banana mini muffins. Well, Nora's helping, but she's also snacking. You having a snack? And after that, yeah, I want to have oh, a yum. taste test. You're gonna have a taste test of our muffins? First step, mash, mash three banana. ripe bananas. My kids love making these delicious banana mini muffins with me. We use them for either a quick breakfast in the morning with a big side of fruit, or they love to have them as snack after school as well. These muffins come out to one point for one, three points for two, or five points for three, which is what I would do for a breakfast on the WW plan. There you go. Yeah, I did it. Good job. <laughs> In your turn, you want to mix? Mix, mix, mix. Mix it up. Good job. Nope, don't eat it. <laughs> I'll put the full recipe with ingredients and instructions in the description box below. What are you doing? Mixing? Mix, mix, mix. Oh. Oh, and you were putting the eggs in? You guys are doing a great job baking. What step are we on, Lila? We added vanilla. Oh, we need a pinch of salt. Pinch of salt. You're a good help with this one. Is that taco tips? Can you taste test one for me? Take one. Just one. Take one. Nora, take one. Quality control. About a half a cup. I use a small cookie scoop and a silicone mini muffin pan to make baking and cleanup super easy. What do you think? Delicious! Out of 10. What does that mean? 20 billion. Oh my. Muffins are out of the oven and look at how easy, just pop. Out they come. I love this silicone pan. Pop. 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 Reminds me of one of those poppy toys. Well guys, thanks so much for joining me for a breakfast meal prep. I'm so glad I have these meals as quick grab and goes for breakfast in the morning when I'm running around busy with these ones. Well, I'm glad I have some healthy breakfast options available. Now hopefully mommy gets to eat them and they're not just all stolen by the kiddos. Still trying to figure out how many points do I deduct from each meal when my kids take bites of them all. 
there should be mommy bonus points on WW. Anyway, thanks so much for watching today's video. Please hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on my next one. And until next time, can you say bye-bye? Bye-bye. Bye! -bye? bye, -bye. bye. But I get up, I always do.